Hello everyone and welcome back to Niche, the genetic survival game. And we are here with our little tribe of Hoshina. That's kind of what we've called, well I said tribe, but I guess this is our pack. Our little pack of Hoshina, which is the group we've called these guys. And so far they have managed to survive, which is kind of a miracle. We've even found some more berry bushes. We just had our panda elder, our little blind panda elder. Unfortunately, he just passed away. That's so sad. But we did find two more berry bushes that we have perched next to and we have a beautiful pregnant female right here Rarara who's one of our best fighters and we've kind of got everybody scattered around quite a bit who is this it's Ramimi he's gonna die of old age any minute now no I'm gonna be so sad but we're actually pretty low on females and pretty low on babies so even though everybody may be a little bit more related than we really want I'm gonna start having a whole bunch of our little animals start breeding so let's go ahead and let the day pass Oh yeah, she's pregnant too! I totally forgot we had two pregnant females! Okay, well let's see. We can get her over here first. And then we can get him to start gathering these up. Uh, let's gather up a little bit from both bushes. And then you, my friend, are pretty strong. Oh! So we're gonna have you come over here and start fighting this one. Animale! Who, who else can fight? Oh no! Okay, we have, we have a bit of a battle going on. Animalay is not very strong, but we need every fighter we can get. So we're going to throw our fighters over there. You stay there. You're kind of a tough little fighter, but you're just a little guy, Ramane, or a little girl. Oh, but I guess we need every single, every single creature we can to fight. And then let's see. I need some food. Oh, thank goodness. And there's food to be gathered from the, the little rabbits that are hopping around here. And then let's see. Can we scooch you over? You can't collect? What is the point of having so many of these guys who can't gather anything? Oh my gosh, and Ramimi is about to die. Well, this got exciting really quickly. Let's try not to keep death from the swamp headed towards us. So let's see if we can kill that guy and feast upon his body because that's what we do. All right, we've got five strength here. Yes, that was what I wanted to see. And then Ramimi died. No, I'm going to miss Ramimi so much. Oh man, and then let's go ahead, come over here. All right, you can stop all of your wiggling, you little bun buns. All right, we'll try to get all of the bunnies. We'll leave him there, and then she's gonna come over. Okay, you can also fight things, you can collect. It's so interesting to kind of see the different traits that they have and how we try to make all, uh, can I get, yes! Food, there's so many bunnies over here. Yeah, it is so interesting to see the different traits they have and how we try to use those traits to take care of our creatures. So this is Anna Malaya, and she is, she's she got that spit snout again. Oh my goodness. I've been trying to breed the family so they can be pretty with spots and ram horns like this one, Nunu Van. Okay, so this is Nunu Van. Has a strong immune system with A and C. Um, so they shouldn't get sick as often. Is that double claw? Yes, double claw, ram horn. We've got dots. We've got the ability for stripes. That is so awesome. <gasps> Look at that strength. What a strong little guy this is. So we've got a really, really strong little male here. So we want to keep him around for sure so that he'll be able to take care of everybody. We're going to move her over and hopefully have her. Oh, she can't gather anything. Why do I have all of these little ones who can't gather anything? What is the point of that? What have I done? What have I done? All right, we'll go ahead and have some exploring go on. Can you gather something? You can gather something at least. So let's scooch you down and you can gather from here. There we go. All right, so we've got, we've got hopefully like the new king line of our genetics, what we're after. Nudu Van kind of represents what we're after, except we do need some berry gatherers because the berries are a pretty reliable source of food too. All right, oh, look, there we go. All right, got that. So we collected from there, collected from here. So there's a lot of berries to gather. And then this guy is really strong. So Kiravan, he's gonna do a little bit of exploring. Aha, there is a creature to eat. Can I get over there? If I can just get over here. Yes, all right, so there's some bunnies coming in from that side. So we'll have them feast. And then Animalia, we'll go ahead and have you gather these up. All right, and then I can't gather those bunnies yet. And then we need to get the baby out. So he's strong. He's going to be like a good battler when we get there. And then here we go. Isko, our pregnant female, who also can't gather berries. We're turning into more of a war, like a war pack. All right. We can gather up that meat at least. No, don't be sick. It's because they're in the 
the swamp. Oh no, I didn't want her to do that. Okay. Well, at least we can kind of keep an eye out on things. All right, we're gathering up food a little bit more successfully this time. And keeping an eye out for bunnies everywhere. <gasps> Look at the babies! Oh wow, we're seeing so many spots now. And so this one, yes! So Dooku here is a gatherer at least. So we're carrying on the gathering. Has the dots. Has okay immunity. Has, uh, let's see, runner leg and no paw. So is it missing a leg? That's so interesting. I'm still trying to make heads and tails of what all the genetic bits and pieces are. But let's try out something new. We have berry paw. I might swap that out for dots or maybe claw because that gives you plus two strength. So let's try doing both berry paw and strength and see what that happens with our newest babies. Speaking of newest babies, I probably need to make some babies, even if I don't really know like how the, the mix and match will, will go. Okay, come on. Come back here, you little bunny. I definitely need more bunnies. All right, we'll, we'll work on getting that bunny. And then Animalay, you can go ahead. Should you have a baby with him? What's your immunity? GG. No, she's not very healthy. She's well, but she doesn't have overlapping immunity, so we'll send her over, get her pregnant, because we need to have more babies. And then let's see, Dooku, Dooku. I would love to see the green eyes come out, actually. He's got green eyes, actually, so maybe we'll get green eyes. No, she doesn't carry it though. Alright, so yeah, I still can't make heads or tails of some of these <laughs> some of these events and some of these things. So I apologize if we're just sort of running in circles trying to make sense of all of it. Alright, but we'll get there. Alright, and she has grown up. So Rememe has grown up, and I think she might be good to breed. Do they have overlapping immunity? C and G. A and C. So unfortunately they do have overlapping immunity. But she's so strong. Well, actually, she's not so strong. He's so strong. Oh, I just have all these strong males. Fooey. All right. And then let's scooch this little guy over here so he can help out. And let's go ahead and eat up these bunnies. And send her into here so she can go ahead and have lots of babies. And then this is our strongest guy, Nunu Van. I really need to find him a good female we can breed him with to be able to have... Oh, no! No, not my pregnant female! Hang in there, little guy. Oh, he did it! <laughs> he is our new... He is definitely our new leader of the tribe, if you ask me. Nunu Van, I think he took a little bit of damage from his hunger. I'm so sorry, little guy. But the good news is he was able to... Oh, you can collect things? Sweet. Okay, we'll move you over here. The good news is he was able to make that attack. So you definitely want to make sure that you have gathered up everything you can. Uh, Food-wise before you really start having them explore or go out and attack things I'm gonna have him do a little bit of exploring so we can clear the area around camp and have some warning if another carnivore comes this way I guess I should say predator because we're carnivores too. We're omnivores. We've been eating both the berries Oh, it's a good thing. We're omnivores. Wouldn't that be hard if like only maybe spit snout let you eat meat and only um, Like berry paw let you eat berries. That would be kind of hard. That would definitely add another layer to it so Rotata is about to die, unfortunately, but I have this female. Do I have any other females once you get big enough, little one? I really want Nunu Van to have someone to breed with. So I think I'm going to bring uh, Ra, 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 Ra Namna, or Ra Nami. Oh my gosh, there's so many names. I'm going to bring her back down. Collect up the food, collect up the food, and Isoka, did you already have your baby? She did already have her baby, so I guess I could send her down. We'll send her back into the wilds looking for bunnies, I think. Because bunnies are a good food spot. And we'll send him over. Yes! Gather up those bunnies. Oh, she's out of moves. That's okay. And we'll get her over here to have the baby. And then he could probably... He's been sitting here keeping an eye on all these bunnies. But we could probably move him, because there's been a lot of bunnies. There's a whole nother... Oh, there we go. Yeah, I got a bunny. There we go. And she... <laughs> Arara is very strong. Oh, maybe... New van. I think... I think... Oh, no! He died of old age! And who's the baby? A female! Look how strong she is! Yes! But I think that she's actually the sister. Okay, genetics-wise, G and F. A and C. <gasps> yes! We have it! We have a strong little one! I'm so excited. She can't gather anything, but she can probably do a lot of, like, bunny hunting. So at least we've got that down. And then I guess Ravari, Ravari can go and breed with someone? 
What are you? You're a female. You're a female. I guess she bred with this guy and it turned out all right. And then let's see, Isoko is a female. Oh dear. We need some help. <laughs> So let's go, let's go and attack you. So we're gonna have some attacking going on over there and then we'll have some berry gathering going on over here. And then he's about to die of old age. This is very, very likely Rotata's last moments. So we'll have him do that. And then, oh no, Kirvin's about to die too. Kirvin, why? <laughs> no, we'll have you do more exploring as your like final move, I guess. And then Nunuvan. <laughs> He's gonna come over and help because he's he's a bit of a fighter that way. No, we've lost more to old age. All right, let's go ahead and destroy this guy. Come on, down he goes. Yes, all right, got that. And then we can go ahead and come over. <gasps> a new one! Taduke, welcome! So we found Taduke. He's kind of our guy of the, the desert. So discovery in the desert here. But yeah, I guess the point and that's kind of what we're at right now, is figuring out what- What is that buddy doing?! <gasps> we have a carnivorous bun bun on our hands! Look at that! Look at the carnivorous bunny! Oh gosh, we're gonna have to watch out. I have a feeling- I just feel like that could be like a special danger bun. He's actually secretly quite hard to fight. Look at all of these cactuses. I guess the cactuses are only good to collect from though, if you happen to have like extras that you're not really worried about. But I might send this guy up to our spot with all of the extra berry bushes over here so he can resume he's the new berry bush gatherer and then animalea is about to pass away but we could bring her over here and maybe try breeding them together so what is this oh she's pregnant never mind she's already expecting all right kiso you're gonna come over because you are going to breed come on little one you're gonna breed with uh nunuvan who's really really strong they don't have overlapping genetics so it should be okay and then we'll explore that. I guess our goal right now will just be to explore as much as we can. All right, Kiervan. I'm going to let you get a good look at everything you want, little old man. Because he's not hes not going to be around much longer, you guys. It's so sad. All right. And then you can do some gathering. So we'll have you do some gathering. And we'll have you do some gathering, my dear. And then let's see. Yeah, she's already pregnant too. So we'll get her in there. I totally forgot she was pregnant again. All right, so there we go. So yeah, I think that's what we're gonna focus on right now. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, my old man. <gasps> Ooh, who do we have? <gasps> Look at you. Oh, this is even more perfect. This is even more perfect because this is Ruvunu and we've got collecting and strength and green eyes and ram horn and stripes. So I'm pretty happy about that. G and F immunity. So sister basic or brother to this one right here. So we can't breed them unfortunately, but man, that is so cool. That's that's the kind of look I want. So we'll we'll kind of aim for that look while we're trying to keep everyone alive. So let's see. What can she do? She can do some berry gathering. Going to move her over here. And then you can do some berry gathering, Dooku. So we'll have you do some berry gathering. Got a new baby. And then Kiso, who can't really do do too much that way. And then we've got, can I get you? Ah, Ravara, who I think would love to be able to get some bunnies. Ah, oh, there we go. Ah, oh, so many bunnies. Yes. What? 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 I got like two seconds to enjoy having that one with us. And then he died. Okay, nobody move. Nobody move until we can gather some more things next next turn. So everybody hold still. I don't want our little prince to die. All right, and now we can gather up some of the fruit and hopefully that'll be okay. And we have Taduk, our new guy. No, I didn't want him to explore that. I wanted him to be able to go ahead and collect from it. Off we. All right, well, we'll gather up this. There we go. And then let's see, who's here? Okay, Renuvu who can do gathering good. Uh, and we wanna move you over. I need to wait till we have a female you can actually interact with. And then you, my friend, come over here, gather up this, and then just sit there. Just sit there and be a good little gatherer. And I guess I could have Nunuvan maybe do a little bit, oh, ha, ha, dead bunny. Nunuvan can come over and gather up some of the meat there. So yeah, it's kind of tricky because I wanna do a lot more exploring. But I'm still figuring out like everything we t in quote unquote should do. And I feel like we should explore the swampland and the grassland more than we should explore the desert. So I'm actually gonna move towards there. All right, there we go. That used up a lot of food. So yeah, I guess exploring and conquest of the area. No, don't you get sick, little Ruvan. Oh, geez, there's some food, yay. 
All right, you stay there. Ravara, you don't need to breed with this guy, I don't think. Oh, she is really strong though. <gasps> Ooh, what would happen if we had a six and a seven in strength breed? Can they breed? A and G, A and C. No, too, too risky, too risky, I think. They might get sick. I think they're actually mother and son. Who knows? It's really hard. If you could have like a family tree, that would definitely help me out. But I guess the immunity chart is kind of the family tree. So now we have Dooku. And we have Kios right over here, who's pretty strong. And then we've got our new little guy who's sick. He's got the common cold. You're not supposed to be able to get sick. <laughs> You've got all of the special abilities I want to pass on to the next generation. Oh, no. All right, we'll do some more exploring down here to make sure we can keep an eye on this bunny burrow. And then, yeah, I don't think these two should breed. But at the same time, you know what? I'm going to do it just, just because I think it would be interesting to see what they would have together. Oh, geez. Okay, wait. Somebody gather up some food. All right, there we go. And I probably need to move Anamale at some point so we can gather up food. Yeah, it's really tricky. We need to have more, like, of the bunnies. No! We have a death. That was dramatic. That was a very overdramatic no. I'm sorry. I just was like, oh, I had everything all planned out. And then they go and die on me. That's very tricky. All right, we'll move right here. You sit there. And then you get over to your spot. You can't move any further because you're pregnant. Okay, everybody hold still. I really do need to keep a better eye on, on like, no, don't you get sick. You're supposed to be like my little prodigy. All right, and meanwhile, you look right there. Phooey, I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay, I'm getting, oh no, help, Ravara, no. Oh my goodness gracious, oh food. Oh, thank goodness. And now Ravara can defend herself, as she should. And now we should have Kios come over and defend himself. There we go. He gathered up some food, even though he took a little bit of damage over it. But that was a good fight. Maybe I should just have... I mean, look at how much food that was. Maybe I should just send them all out to fight. <gasps> Who's this? We found a youth in the grass. Rokir. Okay, so I don't know quite what I'm supposed to be doing other than expanding our exploration. And I think we're doing a good job on that at just being able to explore a little bit further. We now have a new youth who's really good at collecting things. So I might just perch him next to some berry bushes that maybe, is there a berry bush over here? No, but we can do a little bit more exploring. I think that that's kind of going to be our next goal is just to explore as much as possible with our creatures uh, while trying to keep them alive and following the generations and trying to carry out certain traits that I really like. Like I love Nunu Van's traits, so I need to send him back over to start breeding a lot with our females, actually. So we'll have to work on that, and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye